Okay, so I wanted to come in and show you some of my favorite lures today. Well, for uh, the SDXL model, uh, there's not very many of them out there, but I have found, I think, three or four, maybe just three that I am liking a lot. Um, so today, hold on, what we'll be looking at is... There we go. So what we'll be looking at today is, well, of course, uh, the Dream Shaper model. Uh, I've been playing around mostly with that. I have tried out a few others, but so far this one for SDXL is my favorite Laura or my favorite model to play with. Um, I have done a, a few things on it. Um, I haven't been able to do much because for some reason uh, the summertime and it is unbelievably hot in my room. So I turn on my computer for a little bit and I run it for a little bit and I, it, it just it, it ends up just getting too hot. So I end up turning it off and I have to I have like four four fans in my room running and I have to keep them on at all times. That's why I haven't been really recording because it, it's just too much noise for for me to record. So I've been liking the Dream Shaper model um, by like on here. He does have a Patreon. He has a coffee. He has a discord. I need to get on that discord. I don't know if I got on that discord yet. Um, and there's some Twitters and some some other stuff here. Um, I have been liking, I, I, I just found this one today and I played around with it. I'll show you some of the pictures that I did with it. This one I'm liking a lot, but it is very, um, it's, it, it's very temperamental. Uh, what I had to do was end up coming in here and I think I grabbed, let's see, which one did I grab? Oh, I grabbed, I think I grabbed this one. Okay. I grabbed, I grabbed this one. I grabbed this prompt. Sorry. And it's not working for me right now. What's going on? Okay, there you go. And now it's taking some time. Oh, I think um, they might be having some issues. Civit AI has been having issues sometimes, uh, but from Faya, uh, I've been liking this one, uh, th this model a lot. But I had to, I had to come in here and grab. I grabbed this Laura, I mean this prompt, and I came over here and I grabbed this prompt here, the unicorn one, and I messed around with it. I kept playing around with it. What I recommend is if you're if you're having a problem with uh, SDXL prompts, try grabbing some of these prompts and then playing around with them, taking some things out, adding some things. Uh, I do. I have heard that a lot of people are having problems. I've heard a lot of people say that this model sucks, and I think, to be honest, I think if 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 these people are coming out and saying that this model sucks, I honestly think that they just have a problem with their prompts. They're not able to to, to make their prompts. Um, if you compare base models from SDXL and uh, 1.5 or 2.1 you'll see that the SDXL is making some really good stuff and the prompts are easier to, to use, but it just takes a little bit of a, of a, of a trick to get into them. I don't think the prompting, uh, prompting method is the same as uh, 1.5. I think a lot of people are having problems because of that. There's definitely not an, uh, uh, as, as many Lauras with uh, 1.5 as there is with SDXL. I think a lot of people are having problems with that. Um, I have noticed that if you use artist names in SDXL, it, they come out a lot better than if you don't, than if you just try uh, regular prompts. So you might want to try that. Um, but I'm liking SDXL a lot. I, I can't understand why, really, why people are saying that it, it, it sucks a lot. Uh, I'm liking it a lot. I do notice that there's not there's not that many prompts, but it is really good. Uh, Faya does have a really good one here. Uh, the prompts are kind of tricky. Uh, I, I, I'm having to generate a lot to, to get kind of something that looks good. So what I kind of recommend is coming in here, grabbing some of her prompts and seeing what works. And then like, like just taking out what you want, adding in what you want. Also, I was watching, uh, um, I forgot. He did work with uh, Stable Diffusion on this. He does have a, um, a, a, a YouTube channel. But what he was saying was that negative prompts uh aren't working so well or, or, or it's 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 asking for less negative prompts so i've been playing around with less like, like trying to not use any negative prompts on this one and he also said instead of um like coming over here and uh um i'll, I'll show you later 
Um, I'll show you later what, what I'm talking about with, with, with those prompts. But what, I, what I'm playing with today is the SDXL Dragon Style by Feia here. And uh, she does have a coffee here. Um, I have seen her uh, in the uh, Stable Diffusion um, Discord uh, coming up, but I really haven't. I'm, I'm more of a lurker in the Stable Diffusion uh, um, Discord. I don't really, I don't really talk to people. I just kind of look and see what what people are saying. And if I have an issue, I will ask for a question or ask for help. But other than that, I really, I really don't say much. Uh, but she does have a coffee here, so if you have any, you know, you know, money, it's good to give to her. Um, a dream shaper here, like I said, he has a coffee, he has a Patreon. If you have money, this guy, I, I can already tell you, he's gonna make some really good prompts. Oh, the Gregor Lewandowski, I did, I did, I did mess with this one around a little bit too. This one was also a good Laura. So if you're looking for good Laura's, uh, a good checkpoint is dream sha dream shaper here. Um, the the Greg Lewandowski one, that one was a really good one. Uh, Fiea, she has a good one with the the the, the dragon uh, style, uh, the Wowifier. Oh man, Moon Crypto, he did really he did a really good job on this one. It's very overpowering. A lot of times with this with this Laura, see, I did this one here. Uh, I did this here. A lot of times, like you got to bring it down. Like I brought this one to eight, and that came out really good. But sometimes I'll I'll knock it. I have to knock it all the way down to one. I'll show you with the with the lean beef patty one. I had to knock it all the way down to one to actually get what I want. Um, see this this one here I just I think I just with this one this one I think I left at one as well yeah this one I left at one and you'll just see like like it made a whole bunch of stuff that I thought came out really good I, I really like this Laura this, this one is one of my favorite ones um, I definitely want to play around with this one some more so if you're into making robots if you're into making like like cool things I definitely I definitely um, suggest uh checking out the wall fire by by moon crypto uh i do believe he has a coffee no he has a patreon moon crypto here he has, he has a patreon um i know he made a bunch of other of of, of other uh lores and models for 1.5 so i am i am hoping that he makes another one a whole bunch of or or, or she or they uh, I, I hope moon crypto makes a uh another bunch of uh lores models um for 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 x sdxl uh lean beef patty this 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 was a good this this was a good lore here. I like playing around with this one. I think it came out really well. See, look, um, I have her as a cyborg here. I made it look. I made her as a little chia bee thing. I don't know what the hell you call those things, but I think they're kind of cool. Um, let's see what else did I make her as? Oh, look, I made her as a bodybuilding witch. <laughs> I thought this was funny. Uh, let's see. Uh, I put her out here in space with the nebula running around. Her eyes look look look, look she's kind of stoned. I don't think she smokes, but I, I do think I did I did think that was kind of funny. Uh, let's see, and then the cyborg again. So I think this one, this model here, his name is uh, Jomki. Uh, I thought I thought he did really good with the with, with Lean B Patty. Um, I I really like watching a lot of her content. I think I think she eats a lot of gross food, but I like watching her her put her meals together. <laughs> <laughs> and I do think she is very funny. So she's a lot of fun to work with. I mixed this one with um, with the Wowifier, and I think this one, yeah, see this one, I had to knock it down to zero point one, because uh, everything else was just coming out a little bit too hard, and I didn't I didn't like that. But I knocked it down to zero point one, and I got this this effect out of it. Uh, I tried making her a, a robot, a robot, a little little ka uh, kawaii uh, robot, and I couldn't get it with the Wowifier. I. I um, maybe in the future if if you know some more some more additions come out to it or something like that um this is is kind of um with, with this model or with this lore here i always left it at one because anything less than one was always bringing up somebody else or something else so let's see here right here where you can see this part right here i always left that at one and uh, I would put the, 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 the thing up here, the, the, the trigger word. I would put the trigger word first or wherever I want her, uh, like, like wherever I'm putting, putting for her to be. Um, also, I, I, did, I did notice that, that messing around with, with putting this, uh, the, the Laura, up on top, that would help a little bit sometimes. Um, I'll show you some of the pictures that I made. But also, Eduardo uh, Rodriguez Calazado style. Calazado. I thought this was a really good Laura. Um, I don't think I no. I didn't put any pictures out of this one yet, but I did think this was a really good a really good Laura to play around with. 
Um, like I did notice on this one, like putting 10K resolution got me better faces. He didn't do it. I don't think he did it in this one. I just looked and he didn't do it in this one, but I did notice that like putting 10K resolution, uh, putting some modifiers in it did give me a little bit better of, um, of a resolution on here. Um, oh, and I have, I have, I don't think I dropped down the, the, the lore too much. I think I dropped it down to eight and that was it. So I want to try dropping it down a little bit lower. Like I said, it's really hard for me to kind of run my computer and, 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 and play with SDXL or play with uh, stable diffusion right now because it's summertime and that sun is just baking my roof and I'm on the top building and it is getting unbelievably hot. Like right now, even, even making this recording, I can feel the, the temperature rising because I had to turn off all my fans and everything. Uh, I do like this image here. This image here is really good. I do like this one. The hand kind of came out messed up right there, but like I said, it's just coming out. Uh, I do like this one. This kind of almost looks like it was coming out as a boot, and this one looks more like a sandal. But I do like this image. That's a good image. So these are the models, or the, the lures that I found that I am having a lot of fun with right now. I know there's not that many of a, of a pick, but I am hoping the community picks up on this. Uh, they did say that making SD, uh, SDXL lures are a lot easier. Making SDXL models are a lot easier. So I'm hoping a lot of people can make it. Uh, pl play around and add to it. I have a friend, uh, Apollonius. He is running a laptop with six, six, uh, six, six, six gigabytes of VRAM. And he is getting a, he's getting really good speeds with Comfy UI. Now I don't know exactly what what models of of, of comf, Comfy UI he put in or what what um, what differences or how he 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 put it together. Uh, I am going to learn that later when I get some more time. I have been studying. I have been doing other things uh, because I got a new job and I have to study for that job, but he is getting really good really good timings with 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 his images of just six uh six six um gigabytes of vram so comfy ui if you have like a, a lower end computer you might want to look into that and see if if uh that's the one you want to go with i run with uh automatic 1111 just because i love automatic 1111 to me it's just with everything i can do everything i've learned how to do I've heard you can do a lot with comfy, comfy, um, comfy UI or whatever, but I'm just, I don't know. I'm a big fan of, uh, of automatic 11. I, I want to play around with comfy UI. I, I want to learn how to use it, but I don't think I'll ever switch from automatic 11. I love the fact that when I, when I bring up, um, w when I save a model, like this will come in. Uh, let's see. Do I have the notepad up here? Yes, I do. And transition. So I like the fact that this will come up. Like if I, if, I, if I save something, like all this will come up and it saves in there next to the picture. So if I'm ever wondering, hey, what was that that I had to use? I don't have to throw it back in a comfy UI and find out, okay, okay, this is what I did, this is what I did, that's what I did or whatever. It just automatically pops up. And I'm like, oh, okay, look, look, this is what I did here. This is how I did here. This is what I put the Laura at. And I can mess with that. I don't know if, if comfy UI will save these. It's just little things like that that, that I'm, I'm, I'm really, really liking. I also like, like me, uh, I'm real big at, like if I put this at 1080 and I have this at 1440, I'm really big to where I'll switch it. I'll switch it around just to, just to play with it. Like, okay, if, if I'm doing like a, 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 a low uh, width and a high, uh, high height, I'll, I'll change the aspect. And I love the fact that I can just click onto that and bam, it changes it real quick right away. Now, there might be ways to do that with Comfy UI. I played around with Comfy UI for a little bit with uh, 0 0.9, and it, I, I thought it was okay, but the more and more I learned out, uh, about it, the more and more I liked it, but it never did, like, I don't know, with everything I can do with, with, with Stable Diffusion, I love, I love, I mean, with uh, Automatic 11, this is, this, this is my favorite right here. Uh, but I, I like, I don't know. Uh, he's getting really good timings with Comfy UI uh, to the point to where uh, he wishes he could use Automatic 11, 11, but the, the timings for him, you know, on six 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 VRAM is just is just not it's just not worth it. Uh, it's really hard for him to test things out, but with uh, Comfy UI he can because it's it's running at like uh, I think he's getting like a minute, maybe less. Uh, I thought at one point he told me he was getting 30, 30 second images. 
uh, so somewhere around there or something. So I think for him, Comfy UI is, is, is way, way, way worth it. I definitely want to learn it because I want to learn the UI. But I want to learn Comfy UI and I want to learn the Invoke just because I, I, just because I, I want to learn them. But I think Automatic 11.11 is just always going to be my, my go-to. One thing I am having an issue with that I hope I hope gets changed with SDXL is I haven't heard anything, anything whatsoever about in painting. And I love in painting. And I'm going to be very upset if SDXL doesn't have in painting because I'm like, oh, man. I mean, if that's the case, then I will just go back to 1.5 because in painting is like is like it, 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 it's a big stress reliever for me i love trying to play around and trying to in paint so but i'm i am really hoping that that sooner or later some in painting models come out or or something or 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 something but i'm really hoping that they do that have the 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 in painting models anyways uh back to what i was saying so let's play around and see what i have one moment so I did like this dragon here I thought it I thought I thought it was really cool um, this one I did use the 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 the, the model I was telling you about with the uh, Faya uh, the SD uh, dragon the SD dragon uh, dragon style I, I was using that one um, Hold on one moment, I'll show you the prompt. I'm sorry, I really wasn't uh, expecting to do a video today, but I was like, you know what, I haven't done a video in so long. I feel like if I don't do a video, I'm, I'm going to just end up not making videos anymore. And I don't want that to happen. I've been having to study, I've been having to do a whole bunch of stuff, and then it gets hot in my room. And I, I it's like at the end of the night, I can't, because it's too hot in this room, and I can't, uh, I don't want to. So... And of course, for some reason, it is taking a while. You, usually, uh, one image uh, goes by a lot faster for me than that. So that was my little fairy dragon. So you can tell you can tell that th this prompt is what I used. It's a fairy dragon DTS style. Ah, oh, crap! I keep forgetting to. So you can tell that that's the, the the fairy dragon. So all I did here was put fairy dragon and then the DT and the and the, 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 the 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 what do you call it the Laura. Now somebody was asking me how you load the Lauras, and um, oh man, my video. Okay, somebody was asking me how you load the Lauras. Now what I do to load Lauras is one moment and I'll show you. Okay, one moment. I'm gonna I'm gonna be right back. Okay, so where where you load load your lures is you can put them in here where it says models. Sorry, it's right here. Um, where it says models, it's right under log. Well, for me, it's right under log. You'll put it under there, and then you'll go to where it says Laura, and then you'll just you'll just you'll just put it there. So let's say you have it in your downloads folder. You just copy. I think uh, yeah, I think this one was uh, was a Laura. And you just Control C, copy it. You can go over to where let's see right here, where it says Laura's, and then you just paste it in there, and it's it, it it'll load up. You can see how many Laura's I have in here. Watch, I'll show you where my like all my models. You can see where all the models I have, because I never take my models out. I just leave them in because I know I'm always going to want to use them sooner or later. Um, but you put them in there, and then what I do is get rid of that transition. So what I what I do is this little red red thing right here. You click on that. You come over here. Now, if 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 you've already started Stable Diffusion, this uh, if 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 you've already started Stable Diffusion, what you're going to want to do is hit refresh. And then that'll load the load the Laura. 
and then when you go in it'll be in here somewhere so you just have to take a look uh, what was it was it wildfire XL okay so if it's wildfire XL you're gonna load the wild, wildfire XL here you just click on it and then, and then it'll load up now say you got a you got an image like uh, that one was uh, let me see it was the dragon style right was it DT I think she has a DT style let's see yep DT style okay so say uh, it's the DT style and I want the picture in there so let's see where does it go uh, it used to just pop up I don't know I don't know what it what it's doing now uh, maybe this nope not that let's see description it used to have a little thing to where Hmm, I guess they changed this all around or something. Let's see, let's take a look. Uh oh, did I just change it? I don't know. Oh wow, I've never seen this before. But usually it used to have a thing right here to where it would just pop up. So I'm gonna have to learn how to how to do this now. This is different. This is different. Sorry, guys. I'm wasting your time. But this is different. It used to have just a little thing right here. Oh, wow. Look, it has all this information here, too, now. Hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is actually pretty interesting. I wonder if... I wonder if, like, all this information here is what you can put in there and make the, make the prompt look a little bit better. Uh, Fire Phoenix plus Dragon. Let's try this out real quick. Hold on, hold on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I know I'm trying to. W I'm, I'm wasting your time here a little bit, but let's try this out. Let's copy that. Uh, let's put this here. Let's see. Let's see what happens here. Uh, let's see. 1024. 1024. I'm gonna go with the. Uh, Let's see, let's see. Man, it's starting to take a little bit of time. Oh, hmm. Oh. That is very interesting. Hmm. See how this looks? Now it has a little bit of extra feet and stuff like that. You might be able to change that in the negatives. Um, one of the things that one of the one of, I don't think it was a subscriber, but it, it was someone in the comment section who said um, it's best to start off slow with your 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 your, your negative prompts. I usually just copy uh, a whole list of negative prompts I have. I throw it in there. A lot of times, uh, the negative prompts I I use. What is this? Huh. Save images, preview, tiling. I don't know. Whatever. Um, I usually just copy and paste them. With SDXL, I'm kind of like just running without them. And then trying to see, okay, what's going to work, what's going to work later, or what's going to work. Um, I'm just trying to see what's going to work without them. And then later on, what I'm going to do is take his advice and, and try slowly, like maybe putting, uh, I don't know, perfect feet or, or not mutated feet or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. I'll try, I'll try slowly next time. But, hmm. Okay. So, like with here, you can put in. Um, that 10k high resolution um, okay okay let's see let's see how this uh, how this this improves it and it's the same seed
Okay. I don't think it looks very watercolory, but you do see it. Now, let's play around with this. I'm going to go with the... Uh, I'm going to go with a 5. Let's go with a 5. Let's bring it down to half and see what it does. I really like the Dream Shaper model. Wow. See? And that's that I mean I mean just doing those little simple things of playing around with it. You, you can see how it how it how it um, how it kind of uh, like made it look so much better than the other ones. Now let's take a look at this. Um, let's see what it looks like on parchment paper. see I think that looks pretty good uh, I don't think the parchment paper really came out on it so let's try now okay another thing okay this is what I was trying to say the brackets now what 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 he was saying was that instead of like instead of doing this where you where you where you multiply what you want he was saying it was best to like like put the brackets to where it it, uh, it 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 I don't know how to say the word to where it like brings it down. Okay, because those the, okay because those kind of brackets that that's that's like uh, uh, ma ma making it okay. I, that's emphasizing that you want that more, and then the other brackets those those, those brackets. Those brackets are showing that you want that less, but that I don't know. That's kind of that that kind of makes it harder to me though because it's kind of like well, it's easier to to pick out. Okay, this is what I want more in the pit image than it is to pick out. Okay, I want this less in the image, because if you have it in there, you kind of want it all in the image. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna keep going with this. One, another thing I, I want to tell you is 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 don't let somebody tell you that you're doing something wrong if something is working out for you. The only time I let somebody do that for me is when I'm working, when I'm, like it's the actual job. Because you never know like when later on, like 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 during training, you're gonna find out, oh, okay, now I know why this person said I'm doing it wrong. But if you're if you're playing something like this, I don't know, if something's working for you, go for it. If if putting extra fingers in the in the in the in the negative prompt works for you and that actually gets you better hands, put extra fingers in there. Um it shouldn't from from what I heard, but if it's if it is, then yeah, just just go with it. Do it. Uh whatever's working for you, you know, if it works for you, it works for you. Hmm. But that is pretty interesting. I do want to show you guys that again. So if you go here and you hit on this little exclamation point, not all of them have it apparently. Uh, I guess the SDXL ones do now, because that that's the only that's those are the only models I'm seeing it on. Oh yeah, so I'm guessing. Yeah, and you can see what it's gonna like what words are, are gonna are gonna work with it or, or or something like that so that's pretty nice that's pretty nice new i i i, I i've never never thought about that before I wonder what the exit uh wall fire has hmm. but like i said this is a this is a a really different different uh laura um, this one for me was, was, was kind of hard, hard for me to understand or hard for, hard for me to get a, a, a hold on. You will want to play around with this. If you want, I can even do this. 
Let's try. Okay, let's try this. Because I usually get when I add when I put both of them together, I usually get I usually get some pretty good images. But I never want to just put one person because I don't always I don't ever want just one person's style. I always want I always want two or three or four. Some the most I ever go up to is four. The least I ever go down to is two. I don't like putting just one person's person's name on there. But see, this came out really good. I like this one. But there's a little tip. Um, I'm I'm really liking uh, adding um, uh, Frank uh, Frazetta and and Hayu Miyazaki. I like I like adding them two together. I know that like their 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 styles like their their work doesn't really actually go go. Um, you never really think of them two together. Uh, but but uh, I do know that. They do often uh, make some really good images when you put them together. Now let's try this one. Let's try it when you switch it. Oh crap! And I didn't take out. Oh wow, he's coming out with, with good legs. Well, the legs came out better, and the wings came out really good. I have noticed with this lore, it is kind of tricky to get two two good looking wings. A lot of times, uh, maybe one wing will come out okay, and then the other wing will just be missing. Or sometimes, like one wing will come out like kind of bad, and then there won't be another wing at all. But uh, it is it is kind of hard to get two wings going out with this one. But I, I am liking this lore. I'm liking this lore a lot. Where was it? Okay. And then um, I already showed you her. The Lean B Patty one. Um, I've been playing around with this one a lot. Um, I think I think I think Lean B Patty makes a really good Laura. Um, I might be making more images w w with her in it. Uh, I really like the Chia B one. Um, I really I really like the workout witch. I like I like how I like how the feet came out how they're barefoot and she's just standing in the, in the it just makes me think of a rough girl. Um, I like the forest. Uh, I think this one I used the Greg Greg um, here. Uh, yeah, I, I do believe I used Greg Greg Rutowski, uh, uh Laura in it with it. Let's take a look. Yes, I did. Oh, sorry. Uh, yes, I, I used the Greg Rutowski, uh Laura. Um, and that is the prompt. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And I put her as a. Uh, now this one was kind of weird because sometimes, when I would put bodybuilder in there or when I would put muscular, it would make it would make uh, lean beef patty, but it would make her with a man's body. <laughs> she would be shirtless with a man's body, and I was like, That's, it was it was kind of funny, but it was also kind of scary. But I think this one came out good. Uh, there were only three fingers right here, but I do like that image. I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, let's see. 
Now, here was another one that I used with um, uh, the dragon. This this was a dragon, uh, the, the, the dragon lore. I thought this was really cool. Um, I'll, I'll put I'll put all the prompts down uh, in the in the description too as as normal. Um, yeah, yeah, I'll put all the prompts down in the description. Uh, I might not put the Loras down because the Loras, uh, the, uh, uh, what you call it, uh, YouTube doesn't like it when I put the Loras down. I always have to take the brackets out, so you won't be able to just copy and paste them and put them in there. You'll have to actually load the Laura, but. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll put down like most of the lore in there and then you can just see where I put the settings at because you can see here um, oh this one this one oh no wait that was that um, but I like this one this one was just uh, this one alone was just the, the the moon crypto and I think all of them were pretty much dream shaper I think the only one that I didn't use dream shaper was with uh, maybe the, the, the this one I think this one wasn't dream shaper but I'll, I'll put the I'll put the descriptions down in there there so so you can play around with the prompts or uh, actually you can go to go to go to Civ Civit AI um, I'm not gonna put them down in there because that's that's annoying to me because because I have to like take out things and, and get it to work in there so what you can do is go down to Civit AI or you know what yeah I will because that is gonna be kind of a work because like like here like Dream Shaper if you want to look for them uh, you have to go all the way down to the bottom you can't always go in here too like some of these people they'll they'll put the prompts in there you can always go in the prompt copy it paste it and just try and make it work if you're having an issue with like something that you're trying to play around with um i do know in the lean beef patty one nobody's putting any images in there so it's a little bit easier um i i, I need to go put some 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 pictures in here because she did really good on this and i, I do want to i do want to let you know let her see her but um no i keep i always forget to keep the picture up there but yeah that moon crypto cow uh they they did a really good one with this with this Laura. I really like how how it makes like the robots and it makes the astronauts. I'm really I'm really liking this. And then this one was the dragon one again, because I used pastel. I used I used pastel to get these colors here, and and SDXL put them as these colors, and and then I I put it as a a butterfly. But. You, you you'll find I'll, I'll put them in the description i'll put them in the description all my all my little prompts that way you can you can take them you can play around with them and you can see what works for you and um you can also see the seed you can play around with the seed see if you're getting the same thing uh, i do know if you put the seed in the, if you're using comfy ai you will get different images um and that's another thing like like with automatic 11 11 i can like everything comes up in that notepad so i can just copy those 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 um those prompts and then just paste them and with uh with with comfy ui i can't i can't really do that i can't copy them and paste them and put them anywhere because it's like i gotta throw it in the image i gotta copy everything one by one i gotta yeah it's it's i don't know i like comfy ui it's just that for me it, like everything that i like doing it, it's so much easier to do with um what do you call it with 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 automatic 1111 i love automatic 1111 i think it's i think it's a great tool i, I love it a lot um i'm liking this a lot too I, I really like her dragon her little dragon laura oh yeah i like this one a lot see how how the butterfly is right here and then and then the dragon is behind it at first i thought it was it was just this and then and then when i was glancing at it at once i was like oh hey wait there's the dragon there's the dragon right there i was like wow so I'm liking like this a lot. Now you can see right here, the dragon does connect into the butterfly. I, I, I that that part I don't like. That's why I'm really hoping that they bring in some impainting. I think I think this really needs impainting. And this one I really liked a lot, though that kind of made me think of like a grasshopper thing or something. That's why that could be fixed with impainting or something. And I really hope that they do bring it in. The eyes could be better done done a little bit better like this this is not a bad model i don't know why i don't know why i'm reading on here and people are like it sucks it sucks i'm thinking it's just their prompts i'm thinking that, that, that they're, they're thinking that they can just come in and use uh 1.5 and it's going to be good and it's not now this one i used uh i used both i used the dragon uh the dragon the dragon um i do believe i used the dragon one let's see i do believe i used the dragon one on that one hold on where was it? Where was it?
Nope. That was just Moon Crew. Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. See, I used I used the dragon one. So, I think I think I think this this lore is really good. Uh, Fiea, thank you very much. She she did a very good job on this. I think um, uh, I think I think this was this was this was this was a really good one. See, you can see the little dragon right there. There you go. It's like he's perching up on something, and he's in. Uh, uh, that 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 does look like a little dragon, though. Compared to like the building and stuff, it looks like a little a little dragon. That looks like a bigger dragon, but kind of, because that looks kind of like a car, and then yeah, it's kind of off. But I don't know. I think like like a lot of this, I think you could fix up with prompt. You could put in better resolution. You could put in better details. You could put in. Uh, you could put in a lot of stuff. I think there's a lot of stuff that could be fixed with this, with just the prompt. But I'm not going to come out here and say that SDXL is, 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 is it sucks. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to say that because I think. I think it's just. It's just more playing around with the prompt that you need to learn. Um, okay, this one here. This was done with. Uh, let's see. One. This was done with. The Eduardo Rodriguez Calzado, Calzado, that was done with that one, and I liked I liked it a lot. I I think there was there were some things you can definitely play around with with it with. Uh, that you know the the prompt was really simple. The, the, these were just uh, Cyberpunk City. That's all I put. So like, it was Cyberpunk City, and then it was just some, you know, some some random seeds, and the the lore was left all the way to one. Um, I wanted to play around with it a little bit more and drop the Laura, but then I ended up just changing the prompts around. But I like I like this a lot. I thought this came out really good. I like this one. Uh, this is uh, th this was just a witch with the same with the same Laura. A witch with the same Laura. Like like I just I'll generate them four at a time, and that's why it came up like that. Little watermark or a little thing. See, okay, I did want to show you guys this. Look at her face. You see how it is? Now, this is just adding, like, uh, okay, 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 hold on. If you look up here, what I'm doing, okay, so the prompt here is gothic painting of a beautiful sexy witch in a horrifying forest wearing a pointy hat and a sleek modern dress uh the sleek modern dress i grabbed off discord i saw someone use that and i was like oh i want to try that and, and it started working out really well so the only thing i added to that let's see where is he now you can go from that to that you see how, how better the face is now it's not it's not perfect uh i did i did generate a few more images after this and i did get better images um they are in here i'll show you was uh let's see i shouldn't i shouldn't be generating these so much because it is getting it is getting a lot hotter in this room now um the only thing i did with that was add 10k resolution 10k resolution and you can see you can see how different the the, 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 the face came out. Uh, that's still kind of a little bit messed up, but it is better than that. And then, so you are getting a little bit better. Like you will get, like if you, like the more, the more modifiers you put in there, you will get a little bit better. You might get a little bit worse. If you get a little bit worse, take that out, try a different modifier. Um, it's a good, I don't know. I'm just getting upset because I'm like, it's a good model. I don't understand. Like, I think people are just having issues and they're like babies and they're crying about it. But I really, I really, I really like this. Um, I think when more Laura's come out, it's going to get even better. I really like this. 
Oh, this was uh, th- okay. This was another Lean B. Patty one. I, I really like this one. I- I'll put this one in there too. But it was supposed to be her and a vampire. Now the prompt I did steal off of uh, Discord. I saw it and I was like, hmm, let me try this. And that's where I got the sleek modern dress. Um, I did change everything else around though. And then and then this one. This one came out really good. Look at her. See, Lean B. Patty. And then it's like a gothic like painting. It's like a, a gothic painting. And uh, this one was just, I think this one was just Mistress. I don't think, I don't think I made her a vampire. But I do like how the way this came out. I think the style was Frank Rosetta and uh, Hayao Miyazaki. And then, and then this one where she's just floating around in Earth. I mean, she's just meditating out and out in there. I don't know. I think she's very funny. I think she's she she does she does a lot to like bring up the community. I really like people like her, like uh uh, uh Free Lixman. Uh, 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 I really like I really like people who are very positive, who try to who try to bring you know bring the community up instead of sitting there and uh, like causing drama with everybody. There's a lot of drama going around. You don't have to get into it. Uh, I don't think you, you need to promote it. Uh, it is what it is. I like people who try to be uplifting. I like people who try to be a positive influence on people's other other people's lives. Um, she does a good job at that. Lex Friedman does a lot a, a really good job at that. Um, I don't know. I, I really like people like that, but these are the three lures I've uh, the, the model and the, you know the lures I found so far. Um, I have played around with with, with a few others, but uh, I didn't really. Uh, it's not that I didn't get into them. I didn't. I didn't really learn that much about them. And then I would see these, and I was like, oh wow, Moon Crypto Cow. Like this was up. Oh wait, not that one. Damn it! I hate it when I click on the wrong thing. This was up like the second day SDXL was out, maybe even the first. Uh, July twenty-six. So maybe it was the first. The first day it was out. Yeah, the first day it was out. It was this was up and ready to go. And and like the like the moment I saw it, I jumped on it like right away because I saw Dream Shaper first, and then I saw this, and I was like, oh no, because because like this was one of my favorite lures for one one point five. Um, he did do a really good job, uh, or they did did a really good job. I I love this I love this whole little group or person or whatever whoever's whoever's messing with this. Uh, Patreon, he has a Patreon. I do believe he has a coffee too. Uh, nope, just a Patreon. So Moon Crypto Cow. Uh, I like if you take a look. Let's take a look at the. Wow, it's running like really slow today. Okay, there you go. Like. He did some really good ones. He did the other wildfire for 1.5. The Insana bot was really good. Oh, I didn't even see this one. The Luna Diffusion. Or maybe I did. I don't remember. But I got to check out that one. And uh, X-Ray Heads. Industrial Machines. He did this one. Or, or, I'm sorry. They did this one. And this was really good. Industrial Machines. If you're playing around with 1.5, Industrial Machines was really good for adding detail. I would put, like, a library and it would add so much detail to a library, but you would ha- I would drop down the, the the modifier down down quite a bit. But industrial machines is really good. It's not just for machines, or I mean I mean it looks like it is, but I mean a simple library, a simple library, it would add so many books, so many hallways, so many boards. It was it was, th- this was really really good. Uh, if you're playing around with 1.5, I do I do suggest you 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 try this one out. Uh, I really like this one. This was a really good detailed one. Uh, but Moon Crypto Cow, uh, if, if you got some bucks, definitely give it to him. Uh, also, uh, Dream Shaper. Uh, let's see. Lycon. Oh, yeah, I went and changed it. Psh, sorry. Sorry, Lycon. Uh, I know he has a coffee, or they have a coffee. They have a coffee and a Patreon. Uh, you can take a look and see. Like this one, like like this group here or this person here, they come out with a lot of stuff, a lot of different stuff. I don't really get off into the anime thing too much, but I mean, I, I like watching anime itself. Like like that, that's if it's not YouTube, it's anime that I watch. But 
I don't get off into like making the anime images too much, but you can definitely do a lot of that. I tried making some anime, uh, some 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 Ghost in the Shell images of of, uh, of uh, uh, Lean Beef Patty, and they were coming out pretty good. I should have I should have put those in there too. Um, but yeah, look look, Lycon definitely makes a lot of stuff. So. If you want to support the group and if you want to get them into making more models and, 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 and helping them make more models and more lures, um, Lycon, uh, Feia did a good one with this one. I do know that she had some other images as well. Yep. Um, let me see. What did I play around with her? I played around with this one with, with, with 1.5. That was really good. Uh, I played around with the style Nebula Magic one. I thought that one was pretty good. Uh, I tried playing around with this one. I didn't. I don't think I got too much into that one. Um, I didn't try this one. This one actually looks pretty cool though. But I do know I tried. I tried these three right here, and I thought they were pretty good. So Fia is really good too. Uh, but definitely help the community out, and they'll help us out. They'll make us more images. You know, two dollars, five dollars, something like that. That usually doesn't hurt. But I'm gonna go now because I gotta turn these fans on and I gotta cool this place down. Um, I'm sorry it's been so long since I made a video, guys. Uh, I really, I really, I really, I really do want to make more, but I gotta study for my job and I gotta, I gotta, I gotta let this room cool down. Hopefully, before next summer, uh, I will be in a downstairs apartment and. Um, Hopefully then I can I can make more videos on a on a on a, a daily basis because then I can make them at night, and it won't be so hot in this room. And um, uh, guys, just remember, hey, you know what? Uh, uh, go out there and and be nice to somebody. Try and uh, you know make the world a better place. That's 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 what we need to do nowadays. Because well, the world's becoming pretty shitty. So try and make the world a better place. You guys have a good day. Uh, I hope I can get another video out but uh, soon, but I'm not too sure when. Uh, maybe next weekend. Maybe next weekend. I should at least try and push push for the weekends. Um, that'll be that'll be really good if I can push for the weekends. But uh, love you guys. Go out. Be nice to somebody. Okay. Have a good day. Bye bye.